We're building a vacuum table for the Avid CNC and it sucks. The whole purpose of this is to hold down materials securely when you don't want to use other hold down methods like tabs, screws, pneumatic nails, clamps, or double-sided tape. This vacuum pump draws suction through this tube, which in terms pulls suction out through the table using this fixture. The rubber gaskets around the outer perimeter prevent any leakage, and hopefully the workpiece stays in place. This is a common technique used on CNC machines and other manufacturing processes. We did not invent this. This piece of MDF is actually a spoil board that goes on top of the vacuum table. Suction is pulled through this and other materials like acrylic, plexiglass, get held in place from the suction coming through the MDF. This whole process has been tested in previous videos and works great, but we're gonna make it even better by using this gasket from All Star CNC. The gasket material comes in sheets with a sticky backing. Pull it off, put it on the MDF where you need it to be, and then cut off the excess. I'm by no means an expert on vacuum tables. I'm learning just like you are. So far, it's been a lot of fun. We're going to secure the vacuum table to this Avid CNC machine and see what kind of performance improvement we get using the gaskets from All Star CNC. This is just a really quick test to see how much suction we're getting through the gasket on the CNC. I think I'm going to move the table before I move it off of it. So the gaskets worked out pretty well for these big pieces where there's more surface area. For these real thin pieces, there was some movement, but I don't think the gaskets are really designed to hold down thin pieces like this. Final thoughts, having a vacuum table is a huge help on the CNC machine. These rubber gaskets from All Star CNC were fantastic for anything that's over four inches. Highly recommend. This pump, not so great for this application. Spits out a lot of oil fumes. Cool, thanks for watching.